Hi, welcome back with me plant do home and garden. This time, I'll give you video about 10 best tropical plants to grow indoors with low maintenance. Well, before go to the video, don't forget to like and subscribe for supports this channel. Also, you can turn on the bell for more updated videos. Okay, let's go to the video. Number 1. Amazon Elephant's Ear Alocasia Amazonica Amazon Elephant's Ear thrives in large pots, both inside and out. It has giant leaves, which can reach several feet wide and long, depending on the specific variety. There are a lot of different and unique foliage types to choose from, so be sure to read the fine print to know what specifically you're getting. These plants make a bold statement in a small space, definitely giving you a feel for the tropics. Number 2. Kentia Palm, Howia Forsteriana. Love palm trees? This is one you'll want to add to your collection. The Kentia Palm is a resilient plant that can thrive in a lot of different conditions. For best results, give it a larger pot and plenty of space to grow into. It could make a perfect centerpiece for an indoor tropical plant area with many other potted options around it. Number 3. Air Plants, Talanzia. A lot of people think air plants aren't real because they just seem to be floating within their pot. They're not, they just don't require any soil. This gives you a lot of flexibility for adding plants on shelves or other places in a house to add interest and color. Air plants are perfect for adding a little bit of tropical flair into any room, interior designers love them for this reason too. Number 4. Golden Pot Hose. Golden Pot Hose features large, heart-shaped leaves and can grow it in a regular pot. However, if you put it in a hanging basket, you'll encourage it to spill over the edges and grow as much as 40 feet if you have the space point 3 it doesn't like direct sunlight, so you don't have to worry about placing it near a window. Keep it watered regularly and you'll have this one for years. Number 5. Aloe Vera. Love the idea of having a healing plant right at your fingertips. Aloe is an awesome indoor plant once you figure out a couple of maintenance basics. First, avoid direct sunlight and instead stick to a bright area. Then, use the deep but infrequent water system, let it dry out between waterings, sometimes a week or more, with the top few inches of soil being dry. As your plant matures, feel free to break a piece off to see and use the aloe inside. Number 6. Ficus Tree. A ficus is one of the most popular options for an indoor tree. You can find both regular, up to 10 feet tall, and miniature options, up to 3 feet tall, to choose from. It's fairly easy to grow, but it doesn't like to be moved. So find it a good home with indirect sunlight, and you'll have a happy plant for quite some time. Number 7. Orchids. Orchids are classic, tropical blooms. The flowers are pristinely elegant, so much so that they can be mistaken as fake. The orchids can be a bit challenging to keep blooming, don't be afraid to try. You can often pick up an orchid at your local garden center or even a grocery store. Number 8. Bird of Paradise. Grown as a perennial in warm places, Bird of Paradise works nicely as a houseplant, as well. Its striking orange and blue blooms give it its tropical look. This plant is popular in public gardens and spaces, so be on the lookout for it when you're traveling to Florida, California, Hawaii, and other sunny places. Like many tropical houseplants, Bird of Paradise plants benefit from a good fertilizer from time to time, so read up on what your specific plant might need. Number 9. Bromeliads. These are classic and colorful houseplants. Bromeliads can come in shades of pink, orange, yellow, and red, with the most famous variety being the pineapple. Bromeliads love humid conditions, so consider spritzing your bromeliads with a spray bottle regularly. To help them get established, try an orchid soil mix. The last number 10. Wax Plant Hoya Carnosa. Wax plants are a fan favorite because they're easy to grow in most conditions. Native to India, these plants are actually part of the milkweed family. If you take a cutting, you can usually start a new plant easily, just use a rooting hormone powder and a soil mix specifically for indoor plants. Don't water this plant until the first few inches have completely dried out, but keep it misted to help it thrive. 
If you like a challenge, try to get it to bloom, it has cool white or pink star-shaped flowers. Thanks for watching my video about 10 best tropical plants to grow indoors with low maintenance. If you like this video, don't forget to like and subscribe for supports our channel. Well, see you in the next videos.